There we go. Labbing time. I'm gonna break down what I'm thinking as I go through these. Uh, I have like a list of stuff to test that I wrote up at work. You guys saw me try and do, you know, 6H1 capital, and wow, does that just not work on Soul. So, uh, I tend to save anything character specific as like super down the line. So, I'm not learning that yet. Um, but, so 6H, this move, is really interesting because if I, let's see, opponent settings, guard all. Uh, I'm just gonna put one on. Normal block. Okay. So, if I do close slash, I can combo into a couple things here, but I, I can like stagger with basically far slash, 5H, and 6H. 6H is definitely like the biggest reward on counter hit, and I do have some options out of it, because I can, you know, cancel this and get air specials. But the problem is I'm fighting Soul, right? He's not set to do anything right now, so let me fix that. But there is a gap between hit one and two here. And uh, you may notice. Okay, I did not expect that to true string. But, uh, yeah, I'm blocking and it's punishing me. So I need to find out if there is a way I can convince people to mash on this gap without making it so I can't use the move. The only thing I can think of, because this doesn't work. Uh huh. Okay, well, anyways, if it whiffs, then he just anti-airs me, so it's still not super reliable. But, uh, my question is basically, I can, cool. Only... Okay, so 5k, 6k does, but there's a gap there. Okay, just to make sure... I don't think that's the Volcanic Viper is faster, but it might be. Okay, never mind. Uh, I guess I just can't use 6H against a soul who's awake. I'm getting full counter hit on this boy. Okay. Uh, if anyone has any ideas for other things to test, please let me know, but, uh... Oof. Yeah, so, uh, here, Dre, this is what I was doing before. So, 6H is a two-hit move on its own, with a gap in the middle. So if you DP the gap, I have to make sure that I can kill him for DPing the gap to give him any reason not to just try it every time, besides, you know, like, input stuff and missing the situation. Uh, and, uh, 2K5 DPRC? <laughs> I'm not sure what you're talking about there. Okay. 
Anyways, what I was saying though is, uh, so 6H, 2 hit move, I can't cancel it into anything except for, I Roman cancel if I want to spend 50 meter, um, but I can cancel it into that, Apple, which gets hit, Turbo Fall, which gets hit, and Bad Moon, where the recovery gets hit. I guess at least if they're not mashing it, they might miss the input. And if nothing else looks like 2K has a gap, I don't know if it's a, like 2K 5D. Uh, let's see if it's just normal. Yeah, okay. Uh, to be fair though, if I wanted to do a quick overhead for 50 meter. Be that. Hmm. 6k? Uh, yeah, 6k is not great. It's pretty slow. Uh, it is technically plus, but you can't convert it without 50 meter. Stop doing that. Oh, it actually has less pushback now. Or er, wait, maybe. Okay. So if it hits, you can't combo off of it. Okay, it is actually much closer now, though. That's good to know. Uh, and basically, if I'm going to use this to, you know, get an overhead to use RC to combo off of, Bad Moon's way faster. Uh, the upside of 6k is if they block it, I don't instantly die. <laughs> uh, Bad Moon, on the other hand... can't move for that whole time. Uh, if you're talking about this move, though, yeah, it seems very... Okay, it seems usable against characters without reversals? Question mark? But let me see how it interacts with 6P. <laughs> Well, with that, I'm not entirely sure what 6H is supposed to be used for. Or, yeah, sorry. You're right. I mean, I know what it's used for in combos, but it, it seems to be a basically a suicide button for pressure, which, like... Fair. It just sucks that, you know, two of her... 6P is not great, but two of her uh, command normals are not super useful that way. Oh well, though. Okay, let me swap to... Um... Leo, yeah, there I'm going to test uh, how tight dash blocking is in this game, is my goal. So in this game, if you hold back, tap forward and or neutral and dash, and then let go and hold back, uh, at least in the earlier betas, you could Skullgirl style dash block, but you could also hold down back and keep moving. 
So, watch my inputs down there. So if you chain those together... Then, in theory... You can just, like, advance forward while blocking. So, I'm going to... Make sure there's not, you know, like, dash startup on dash block. Like a situation where you can't block at the startup while you're running. Sorry, I got a message. Uh, let's do... Oh, that's actually cool as hell. I totally didn't get that. Nice. Um... Wait. Can you make them loop, though? I don't think you can in here. That's unfortunate. Huh. Uh, actually, you know, maybe... Oh, Uh, that's probably bad, but maybe good enough. Looks like maybe there is, unless I am just being a little bit slow on my inputs. anyone think of a more reliable way to test this? Maybe... Yeah, okay, that's tight. Yeah. 
Taking the wheel here. Okay, okay. There is a tiny little gap there. Okay. So, this confirms that you can't dash block out of meaty. But damn, it does that seem to be tight. Um, like, let me set him to counterattack settings. After recovery, uh, one of them's gonna be dash, and he's set to all block, and the other one's gonna be jump. So, just the same thing. Dash, he can block there. Did I forget to set it to random again? I definitely did. Okay. So if he tries to jump, he gets hit. Uh, jump squad is like four frames or something in this game, for the most part, it seems like. But yeah, if you, uh... <laughs> Just not. Jump H is a lower attack. <laughs> okay, yeah, that will never work. Sure. Yeah, okay, so if you get real good at dash blocking, uh, that seems like it'll be real important in this game. Well, something to lab later. Uh, least one friend vulnerable, but it's real small. Your block. You standing P. Long way around. Six P and jump. I would like to test how fake jump kick, air dash jump kick is. Makes sense that it loses the 6 speed to be honest. Okay. Okay, okay. That's about what I expected. and jumpable gap, but those lose 2k and 2s in the light. <laughs> right, if I accidentally go into that, what's my mix up? Um, I'll go there. <laughs> Is it a 
spell something? It is. Oh. That's interesting. Yeah, Dre, uh, IB is basically the same as it was in the earlier betas. Okay, let's see. Come here, Faust. Actually, you know what, y'all? Let's walk some music around. Uh, fastfall after PRC. Oh, are you talking about after the disc? Yeah, that's probably... Oh, wait, sorry, do you mean, like, turbo fall? Yeah, I'll mess with it. Uh, the thing I'm trying to test there specifically, by the way, because I, you know, forgot to mention it earlier, is I'm finding myself in a lot of situations where I'll, like, accidentally go, Oh, shoot, I... Wait, this is my script. It's my stream. Oh shit! I uh, got to 2D on accident uh, because I like thought I hit confirmed and was fucking wrong. Uh, and then I need to, uh, you know, not die. <laughs> if I do that, uh, then at some spacings I'm safe, I think. Uh, maybe not against Faust, you know? But I need to figure out how to uh, not die. <laughs> Like that. <clears throat> um, that looked fake, but maybe. Though the other question is, uh, <clears throat> I guess I could just go down. I guess if I really want to escape, I can always do that, <laughs> but. Oh, the other question is... Ah, yeah, sure. Still probably better to use S in case I misread my meter, because that happens a lot, to be honest. Anyways, uh, I am here to test... During the last beta, I was fighting actually you, Dre. I see you over there in chat. Uh, and I kept finding that I'd go for my basic, like, throw Oki. And Boss would just kind of walk away. <laughs> see, I think he has to, like, crawl forward, right? So he can just walk under disc. That's what I thought. The question is, can I do falling jump kick and hit him in the face? What <laughs> if I do that? Be gone. 
Okay, so I guess I'm glad I played Milia during the first beta, because uh, in beta 2 and on, if you knock someone down, the disc uh, technically no longer meaties them. It seems to be off by one, maybe two frames. Like, it beats throw it comes. But some 6Ps can avoid it. Uh, however, in beta 1, what you got from knockdown was a... You had to manually delay the disc so that you'd get a falling jump K safe jump but it didn't have the, like, minimum height air dash thing. Like, if you see, I press air dash here. And, you know, no air dash came out. You used to be able to just air dash there. So against Faust, I guess I have to, uh, get that timing down if they're crawling. It's gonna be interesting to train my hands to do again. <laughs> With the other question, of course, being, what do I do here? <laughs> I feel like I should be able to time this, because this... Awesome, thank you. Roommate, uh... So, Bad Moon will almost certainly work Got here. You. However, if that gets blocked, I die. <laughs> so, I... My goal, for now at least, is to avoid using Bad Moon. Or, not like avoid using it, but to find as many ways to not be forced to use it as possible. It's kind of the, like... I'm treating it as kind of the equivalent of just DP out of the pressure. It's like, it's there, but like, damn, that's some risk. What are my other options? <laughs> Wait, is that just auto time? The other thing is, I don't actually need to have, like, it'd be nice, but I don't need a way to run mix on the crawl. I need a way to punish the crawl to make him not always go for it, and when he's not crawling, I get the normal mix. You know, he has an extra option, but my goal is to, uh, minimize its impact. Uh, this, this is jump heavy. I don't actually use it too much, unless I have to, because, you know, it hits behind her. Uh, jump kick is a higher attack level, so it's just, like, more plus, uh, and it hits kind of at an arc. Like, this one's easier to use, for sure, but it's less advantageous, so you can combo off of it less times, gaps are larger, all that sort of stuff. But, you know, uh, if I do this... Hold the fuck up. Yeah. 
Okay. Well, so in old games, if you, you know, jump over the opponent, you just normal jump, uh, you don't turn around. If you super jump, you do auto-correct. And yeah, you're right on the, he's not blocking if he's forward crawling. Let me test how all of this interacts with his other, uh, especially notable op- The fuck? He only has two command normals? I thought it was a rule that everyone had three. That's wild. Okay. I, I guess he has items to cover a bunch of slots, but... <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, okay. Right. Yo, get fucked, Faust. Okay. Sick. Uh, I was worried that, you know, Faust, Mr. Amazing 6P man, holy god, his 6P is really good, um, would be able to beat that. But no. So. Okay, okay, okay. So. The, like, the super basic day one Milia Oki is you knock them down with 2D, and you either land and press 2K or 2S, whatever, press all low. You do capple, which makes the disc hit same side, and then you end up on the other side. You're right. Thank you, Dre. I do need to test this 2S. That is incredibly important. <laughs> um, or you air dash, and the disc hits meaty as a cross-up. There you go, you have a three-way mix. Uh, there's definitely, like, extra layers you can add in, but, like, day one million shit, you got it. Uh, some characters can 6P there, but I was worried that, you know, Foss would be able to just crawl to beat the default, like, or the, the cross-up option, I guess, because it loses to both the low and the capital. And then he could 6P either the air one, so make it like a RPS kind of in his favor out of those options. So depending on how 2S interacts, then the RPS is still in Milia's favor, theoretically. It's just a different one, and it's good that I know that now. Yeah, okay, he is doing 2S. Okay, so now the question becomes... Oh, gosh, maybe that's all I'm looking for. Okay. We can crawl, uh... Probably backdash would be the other thing to add in there. He doesn't have any, uh... Reversal normals, right? He only has supers. Well, I mean, I can throw one of those in for sure. Okay, so let's see. If my options are same side capital beats... I'm sorry, that probably just peaked really hard on stream. Um, but okay. So, same side low, which beats crawl, uh, ties to crouch blocking, and, um, I guess we can just ignore 6P, actually. Let me go remove that, because it doesn't fucking work. Oh, yeah, I'll do backdash, there we go. But okay, so if his options are Crawl Forward, Reversal Super, and just hold the mix, then his he only has a real... Hmm. Okay, so 2k, beats Crawl Forward, loses to Reversal Super, ties, hold the mix if he guesses right. Um, Capel beats 
I'm just gonna ignore hold the mix here. So Capel beats uh, Crawl, loses to Super, as does 2K. Super loses to Cross Up Air Dash or Empty. Well, actually, let me test something. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I keep getting, like, when we were fighting Dre, I get so weirded out by Faust going, Shh. Fucking, it keeps throwing me off my game, not gonna lie. It's wild. I'll get used to it eventually, but for right now, I keep being like, what am I doing? Do it late. Hell yeah. Get fucked, Foss. You have to hold the mix for once. Also, just realizing that's punish and not counter hit. Still, though. Uh, okay. Give me a second to write this shit down. I know, like, for real, Faust, it feels fine to me. I am definitely no, you know, fucking top-tier player or anything. But I, I don't think he's bad. He's maybe not the best, for sure, but... I don't know. I don't know. He's probably in the lower half of the cast, actually, but that's more of just, like... You look at the Strive cast. Like, I was thinking this while I was in the tower last night, and I'm like, oh god, it's a May. This sounds like a really rough fight. Followed by, oh god, it's a Soul. Oh god, it's a Geo. Oh no, it's a Potemkin. And at that point, I went, wait, half of the cast is just fucking terrifying. <laughs> Anyways, let me finish typing this, and I'll get back to testing stuff, sorry. This comedian capital beats. I guess just low, yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, otherwise he just holds the mix. Sick. All right. Also, once again, if anyone in chat has things that they want me to lab or like test or whatever, let me know. I'm totally down to. Um, I'm just going through and doing a bunch of my own labbing. Uh, I was sitting at work and being like, God damn, someone get a shirt. Uh, someone make a shirt that, you know, instead of the stupid, like, I wish I were fishing right now thing. I wish I was fucking... Also, you know, you gotta. You gotta. Uh, I wish I was labbing right now. <laughs> yeah, so I wrote up a big, like, list of shit to check when I got home. So, alright, everyone. Uh, do your arm stretches. They are very important. Shoutouts to PS4 load times. <laughs> SSD in a couple days on PC. And native res, hell yeah. Okay. So. May is a fucking menace. <laughs> uh, let's figure out how to beat her. So, the number one thing that I'm having trouble dealing with against May so far... Uh, so, Dre, it's my fingers, wrists, arm, shoulders, and neck. I am just like, this whole area is fucked, and it's not great. 
But if your hands ever get tingly, it is most likely your ulnar nerve in here. So for real, if you haven't done this, put your arm out like so, yeah. You know, hand flat like this, arm straight out, and just 90 degrees down and back up. You can probably feel the stretch in your hands if you don't do this regularly. It's wild and it is super important. <laughs> uh, yeah, so May, she has S Dolphin, which is the fast dolphin. Uh, it is very fast, it is minus on block. And then she has H Dolphin, which has notable startup, uh, you know, like punishable startup, but is plus five on block. And she's May, so she's just gonna fucking. Yeah, you know, whatever. Or. That. Um. So. What most characters can do, and the mission mode in this game actually even shows you this, is you can basically fuzzy mash. Uh, I hate using the term fuzzy, but you can like option select and press your button that will stuff H Dolphin at the time you would be in block stun from S Dolphin. And that's great. That is your like, beat all the maze on floors one through nine strat. <laughs> if you can just OS that. The problem is that Milia's buttons all lose. <laughs> um, so, I'm pretty sure it depends on what move it's canceled from. So that's what I'm testing. Also, how is my volume compared to the game? Am I, I feel like I should probably do that a little bit. Anyways, yeah, so, I tested it briefly. Uh, a lot of characters can just like, Press 5k or far slash or something, and it will just beat H Dolphin clean. Uh, with Milia, I could pretty reliably get it to trade. At best. Think 6p works? So, the option that I did find, actually, um, also doesn't work reliably, but ends with a much better position. Uh, by which, by which what I mean is, uh, and this, I'm pretty sure you can, uh, yeah, you can 5p it, but you have, it's a real fucking tight window. Um, so... What, uh, what I found to do was instant back air dash, and then you still can't punish reliably, but you're in, you know, like, this position here, which Millie is pretty okay with, because then you can do that. <laughs> or you can, like, mix up if you think she's gonna reversal. See how that didn't say punish, though? Uh, it will if it... The dummy is just set to not all guard right now. Oops, command list. Command list is sick, but I don't need to look at it. Well, I mean, hey. As far as fail states go, that's way fucking better than doing this. Because then you get counter hit by May H Dolphin, and I don't know if you saw how much fucking damage that does to Milia. But, uh, so what I want to test here is which normals I can stuff when they're canceled into H Dolphin. You're saying that the, like, the default May string is S Dolphin, H Dolphin, 5K S Dolphin? Okay, let me see if I can re record that. They'll talk on fucking awful at May stuff, because I hate charge motions. Uh, yep, that is now recording one. Sick. Yep, it would help if I remember to charge. There we go. Okay. So let's see. Damn, people are really doing S Dolphin, H Dolphin, actually. S Dolphin's fucking minus. 
That's wild. Right, if it travels further than it breaks the cancel timing. <laughs> This range, can I just fucking... <laughs> I'm too early. God. Okay. Hmm. Well, so the thing is... What you're saying makes sense, and I totally believe it, because S Dolphin goes fast and gets you in, and then if people are like, oh shit, I blocked a dolphin, then they press H Dolphin, and now they're in and it's their turn. I am pretty sure that this situation works better, though, if you just take out the S Dolphin at the start. <laughs> so, instead of S Dolphin, like if they do. Far slash H Dolphin 5KS Dolphin. Then that's probably. Like, it, it's harder for her to get into that situation because she has to actually, you know, move into it, but. Uh, okay. Far slash H Dolphin. That's what I'm doing. That is S Dolphin. Dude, why can I not do this with my hands right now? <laughs> There's definitely a too big gap between the 5k and the S-Dolphin, but like, whatever. Yeah, that's definitely big. Close slash 2. I'm surprised. I swear I was doing this before. Mm, okay, so it's just real tight. do something slightly different. Let's do... Uh, you can go into recording and press play and swap the slot, by the way. Okay. Now... Wait, you can do this here too, actually. There we go. does work from far slash. So if you're seeing I am pressing the button there, 
And a good May will be able to slight delay Astolf into Frame Trap, but against your day one Mays, seems good. Though honestly, I don't really get much off of it. <laughs> You reminded me that dash cancels existed, so I just went and tested all of Milio's and they don't exist. What can you do with it? <laughs> It doesn't look like it's actionable. <laughs> they revert the dash cancels back to how they were in beta 1? <laughs> I wonder if you can dash block with them, actually. That'd be fucking wild. Okay. Yeah, for reference, Charlie, if you weren't here earlier, uh, dash blocking in this game's fucking real good. Uh, it seems like if input correctly, which is, you know, like, not really in human range, uh, I was seeing maybe a two-frame startup window where you could punish it. Let's see, so I'm pretty sure that, yeah, Slash Dolphins I can mess with. Um, heavy Buttons I don't think I can. Yeah, okay, if she does a heavy button, I need to not fucking press things. Okay. Hmm. So the other question would be... Oh god, no. Oh, that looks hella mashable. That doesn't fucking hit. Yeah, okay, that's hella fake. Um... So I guess the last remaining question is 2S, right? Okay. You can mash against... You can fuzzy mash against the non-heavy buttons if the May is not manually delaying the S dolphins.
I'm almost done testing this in particular. Sorry it's taking so long, by the way. Okay, 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 okay. Good Maze will fuck you up with this. I was under the impression that you could OS... Oh, uh, well, that's only from Heavy Button, so that's only from Heavy Button. Um... Wait, I actually need to test S Dolphin. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, so if you are on a button where you, as Milia, can fuzzy mash against S and H Dolphin, you are probably safe to do so unless they're specifically calling it out. On the H buttons, uh, 5H S Dolphin, it does not have a gap. So any May worth their salt is going to be doing 5H slight delay S Dolphin to just manually stagger. Because uh, S Dolphin's minus, why would you block string into a negative mid? But that's only from 5H. From the other ones, if you mash immediately, S will catch you. So they have to be specifically calling it out with a delayed S Dolphin. Which, to be fair, if they're doing it correctly, you might just die if you're trying to mash. But hey, then they have to use S Dolphin to threaten that, and S Dolphin is minus, so you have like a sort of May favored, but still an RPS for how those interact. So that's good. Um. Yeah, I'll be right back while this loads. I'm going to go get some tea. Everybody stretch your hands. Yes, that means you. They can make what look ambiguous, Dre? Are you talking about S versus H Dolphin? Oh, can he not far slash 6H? Or 6H. Uh, okay, he can far slash 5H is his stagger. Is it just close slash 6H? Okay. Hmm. Interesting. What's the, like, the default soul string? I thought it was far slash 6H gunflame. Is it just far slash 5... Or far slash 6S gunflame. Is it just 5H? I guess that's one to test either way, but... Hey, Bullfrog. 
Yeah, no, Soul is, like, by far the freest character in this game, like, the least restricted, it seems, anyways. It's kind of wild. Uh, he definitely does. I just thought that you could far slash 6S. Which, like, to be fair... Hi, I'm Soul. <laughs> but, uh... It yeah, looks like... Low slash success. It must be what it is. Let's see, is that gapped? Is that not? Okay, you do have to manually delay it. That's good to know. Okay, there we go. There we go. It's catching jump start. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Alright, so I just can't fucking challenge that unless I can. Uh... M press. I guess I'll hold it upside down because of the cable. Uh, it's probably because I have RTX voice on, so it's like. Muffling background noise. Yeah, sure as hell can't punish that. Uh, huh. That's fucking wild. <laughs> um, am I missing something here? Am I just missing something obvious? So this soul is just doing close slash, small stagger, 6s. No manual stagger, but like small gap uh, gun flame. So I'm just going to try and jump out of all of these because that's, you know, one of the fastest things you can do. Gets hit. Gets hit. <laughs> and I'm getting hit at grounded both of these. So, uh, you know, I'm not even like getting airborne or anything. So, can I backdash? Nope, it's active. All right, all right. Um, hmm, what else do I have here? Can, wait, can I use Milia privilege, quote unquote? <laughs> no. Okay, I was gonna see if I could do this through. <laughs> nope, it just fucking hits you. Okay. Um. Yep, can't throw it either. And I know you can't backdash the, uh, the gun flame. Okay. Okay. If I faultless the first two, I can dodge the gun flame, I guess? Okay. And, uh, if I faultless, it makes that true string. Still though, um, that's wild. That's real strong. Okay. Uh, well, let's do. I didn't save. I'm so used to having my play and record buttons in a place where I now have my dash macro. Okay. Let's see, did I gap it correctly? Nope. Yep, that hits grounded. 
I'm sure as fuck not mashing against that. And I do wish that this game, uh, they took out Milia's Jump Dust launching grounded opponents. Actually, technically I have not tested this in the final release. Nope. That move, uh, does not work there. And unlike with Mei, this actually is very risky because holy shit does Soul's DP do a lot of damage. Um just to make sure there's nothing bizarre like this, right? Yeah, okay. I didn't think so, but I wanted to just triple check Mirage wouldn't go through it. Yeah, Snackbox Micro, or Snackbox Micro is another one I was looking at. It looked neat. Um, it seemed like a really great thing to have as a travel box, but the M-Press is like, you know, it's the size of a laptop. If I'm going somewhere that I'm going to play fighting games, I can probably bring the M-Press, so I didn't have a huge use for it. Um, at some point, though, Bullfrog, if you're ever interested in the M-Press, let me know. I may end up selling this, actually. I really like it, but uh, hitbox layout has your hands together, and I want a split box. So I'm gonna see if I can like custom order basically an M-Press, but wider. <laughs> if so, I won't need the old one. That That's probably a ways down the line, though. Anyways, as for this, I don't know what to do do in this situation on defense outside of hold it and try not to get wild thrown. Hmm. Well, I guess depending on if I can consider this to be a uh, situation win for Milia, which probably not, but like it's a reset to a specific, like, a particularly wonky part of neutral. And if I am fast enough... <laughs> if I'm fast enough... Then I can at least get there, but... Okay, fair. <laughs> okay, fair. Okay, okay. Well, the thing here, Dre, is that Soul doesn't need to RC, because my options here are so limited. Like, if I jump here, I get fucking hit by 5H. That's what I'm trying to do here, is jump. Uh, and I can, like, jump there, but if I try and mash, I'm just committing suicide. <laughs> I can't throw it. I get counter hit there. So... I have to avoid it, it seems like. Unless... Is it, like, punishable on backdash? No, but that does get me out of that situation. And he... I learned earlier he can't 6S, so this might actually be... Uh, no, Dre, it's not a true block string. It is a tight frame trap. You have to time it manually, though, so, like, they might fuck up. But, you know, competent souls won't. <laughs> it's like how, uh... Uh, I don't know. This is a true block string. That's not. Set him to only block first to demo. Only block first hit. 
This is true block string. That's not. But if he presses a button there, uh, that isn't invincible. Uh, after. Uh huh. Oh, okay. Set so to action two. Or action three. Uh, sure. So he's gonna just press 5P. Oh, that shit's fast. See, he just, like, he can't do anything there. Uh, including the universal pretty fucking fast option that isn't throw. See how he gets hit grounded there? So, what that means... Yeah, so he does this, and if I jump, I just, I get hit grounded during the jump squat frames, to use the smash term. Jump startup, I think, is the FGC standard, but I've seen so many different things used, I just default to the smash one. Um, and that's not getting there. Uh, what does Soul have that he can mix up off far slash with? Uh, what about just fucking... Oh, let's test multiple at once. Okay. So, uh, yeah, pre-jump frames. Let's see. So, souls, far slash, far slash, is a 10-frame gap. Uh, Sage Am was testing it earlier, so... You can mash it if you are... Yeah, I haven't set up the glossary yet. I plan to. Thanks for reminding me. Um, so if he does far slash, far slash, you can just mash it. What about far slash gunflame? Okay, if it's far enough, you can mash. But if it's too close, then, uh, Milia dies anyways. I checked Milia's frame data earlier. Her fastest button is frame six. I get it, but like, god damn it. <laughs> um, okay, 6 H doesn't work. Oh, does 2S not work? Wow, I'm surprised. Okay, I'm just being slow. Um, I guess I'm Milia. The thing I should be testing is 2D. Nope, didn't think so. I don't get anything on that on counter hit. Okay. Yeah, up close that true strings. Okay, so point blank Gunflame uh, traps jump, so you can only reversal it. So let me check something. You can at least take space with that. Hmm. So the scary thing is, every time Soul presses a new button here, it could be Wild Throw. <laughs> or Bandit to, you know. Like, if you do the backdash here, and he, instead of Gunflame, does Bandit, uh, he will just fuck you. Okay. And I had in my notes here, can I stuff the Gunflame startup on reaction? Maybe off of... That? Specifically? Not point blank. Oh god.
I'm just testing different timings on stuff here. Oof. If I could move, like if I was actionable earlier out of that, but. Okay, so I guess my game plan against Soul just has to be chill all the way back here and try and do this over a whiffed button. Okay, okay. That's painful, but doable. Uh, you know what? I have a couple other things I want to lab. But right now, I just want to play some games. Uh, Chari, you're looking for stuff, right? Anyone else in chat looking for games? Uh, Super Jump Turbo Fall was just getting caught. <laughs> also, Turbo Fall has a lot of landing recovery in this game. It's weird. setting that's great all right drag it in here i'll just leave the room id up you know if i was like a bigger streamer i'd probably hide this here but join cowards no Okay. Hopefully this is up long enough. Uh, I'll leave it up for another, like, 10-ish seconds, and, well, I think I can bring it up in here, actually. Yeah. Oh, also, uh, everybody, as a heads up, make sure that you set a stage. Because... This stage lags on PS4. It causes issues with crossplay, but also Chari and I were just playing and we're like, oh god, are our PlayStations overheating? Then we went to a different stage and it was fine. You can't hide the fucking news thing in here. That's annoying. Okay, search ID is at the bottom. Uh, Illyria is fine. It's Axel's stage, actually. The one with the, like, the boats in the background and the people painting. Everybody stretch. Let me hop in a voice chat. Yo. You still looking for games, Cherry? Hmm. 
I think Chari might have stepped away from the computer or something. Okay, well, uh, hey Chari, when you're here, message me. I guess I'm actually just gonna go play in the lobbies for a bit. How many of you in chat have actually gotten to mess with the game yet? Are you ready? I probably should have looked at chat before I accepted that match, huh? Okay, Chari, I'll hop over in a second. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> 